Now it's time for Cat Chat with your hosts, Nate and Mike. Oh, hi, and welcome to Cat Chat, the show where we chat about cats. My name is Nate, and this gentleman over here beside me, well, he's my partner in cat, Mike. Hi, Mike. Hi, Nate. Today's Cat Burglar Cam is sponsored in part by... Cat and Mouse House, fine dining for felines. As always, we like to start the show with a little segment we like to call Cat on the Street. Take it away, Cat on the Street. Um, yeah. Hi, I'm Nick. I'm... <laughs> Do you guys have any cats? We have two. What are their names? Polito and Meat. What kind of cats are they? Well, one's the tiger cat, gray, and the other one's kind of a white and, uh, what would you call it? Kind of orangey? I don't have a cat, sorry. <laughs> what do you love most about your cats? The fact that they don't love me back. <laughs> yeah, why would you name your cat Dick Cheney? He... Oh. Okay, um, how many cats does it take to screw in a light bulb? Zero? <laughs> I think zero is right. Well, that was amusing. <laughs> now that that's out of the way, it's time for our popular new segment, Checking In With Finn, where we check in via the internet with friend of the show and, well, friend of me, Finn. Hi, Finn. Hi, Finn. Motherfucking Nate and Mike. What's up? So, Finn, uh, what have you been working on out there? Well, I've been trying out some rap music. I've been freestyling a bit. Should I? Yeah. Nate, my man, can you blast me down a nasty backtrack? Oh, you know it. This is the cat rap rap and I'm ready to rap. I don't have fleas, don't need to scratch. My eyes are clear, no cataracts. No disease down there in my urinary tract. I don't mean to brag, I don't mean to boast. But organic chow, that's what I like most. You see, it keeps me lean and enriches my coat. Don't scratch the carpet, I scratch the post. So if you disrespect, you'll get the claws. But if you sit and pet, then you'll get the paws. We'll be right back after. We'll be right back after this short break. There's always going to be something to be scared of. Lions, tumors, being accused of a crime you didn't commit, etc, etc. Courage isn't a suitcase filled with canned vegetables. It's a rainbow chasing another rainbow. It's a bag of jelly inside a bag of blood inside another bag of jelly. It's going to be hard. It's going to be dirty. It's going to be scary. But there's always going to be something to be scared of. Lions. Tumors. It's back. Welcome back. Hey, Mike. What? Easy, easy. I just want to know if you like cat tricks. There he is. He's coming down. I can't see him now. Coming. Nice jump, buddy. Bravo! Bravo! You've got meow. You know what that sound means? It's time to check our email. Uh, uh, email. Dear Dr. Carey, my roommate Nate occasionally has his friend Mike over to chat about cats. They set up cameras, move furniture, then turn on a bunch of lights. It can be a bit disruptive, but the upside is that they put out giant bowls of kibble. How do I get them to do this every day? 
Sachi, big buddy. Well, Dr. Carey, what do you think? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, um. Thanks, Dr. Carey. Well, Mike, that's all the time we have for Cat Chat today. Any parting words for the folks at home? You got it. Water be always cold and your treats plentiful. Number five.